Welcome back to the channel. This is Sam and I'm playing the Lord of the Rings book. We just completed uh, Metro Exodus, the whole Metro series. It is available on my page. Sam must die. And this game is giving me creeps, man. Jumping shit. Jump or what? I don't know, man. Well, that jump is not working. Ah, again, I was pressing it. Let's see if I will just do a normal jump. Only path we have. Come on. Oh, 
See what I caught, Lala? Is it a fox? A rat, I'd say. We told you, we see everything. Now come up here. Come up here. There's nowhere for you to go. See what I caught, Lala? Is it a fox? A rat, I'd say. We told you. We see everything. Smeagol didn't try to me. He just went for a swim and got lost. See that shifting wall of mist in the distance, above the last line of trees? We call it the Ring of Haze. Haze! A haze so dense you can't see five paces ahead, tricking your mind. Like a twisted, willful mirror, until you're utterly lost. And sooner or later, 
No matter how hard you try or how far you walk, all paths will lead you back to us. For none can leave or enter our realm without permission. So, as it stands, we must suffer each other's company for a while. Gandalf the Grey convinced our king to let you linger in his halls, which you are now about to see. Come. It's all stone, precious. A whole tree made from stone. Come, Smeagol. The Elf King created that wall of haze. The King's nephew did. Gwendol. Our most splendid mind. Master of spells and riddles. But he is gone now. No biting, no stealing, no creeping. Do you understand? Smeagol swore to be very, very good. I'm touched. Aren't you touched? Very touching words. Where did he go, that master of riddles? A tragedy killed him, and all of his scholars. All but one. Tragedy? You know, why don't you ask our blind child in the cellars? Why her? She's the one who survived. But don't let her get into your head. She cannot be trusted. That's why the king locks her up. Mel is not a prisoner. She is down there so she can heal and doesn't try to leave. Why would the blind elf run off? Because hope is a treacherous thing. She believes that Gwendol is still out there. Enough tales for one day. I am thirsty and your company is tiresome. <laughs> so many elves. And all watching you. What now, so precious? Show some mirth. The blind elf in the cellars ain't those things, they says. And they says, don't trust her. But elves are false. Let's go see for ourselves. He was probably held up in Rivendell. The councils of Elrond tend to be long. Wizards spitting smoke like dragons. What is it? What is it, precious, eh? What is it? Oh, Toby, from the Shire. Want to try? Shire? Baggins is from the Shire? Yes. Bilbo Baggins used to live there. As he was foolish enough to tell you. <laughs> Cruel wizard trying to poison us! <laughs> Be quiet. I didn't mean to scare you tonight. None of us could ever imagine the horrors you must have endured. Least of all these idle folk. I hope you don't bear any grudge. So we was as forgiven, yes. And forgotten. Gracious oh, wizard. Gracious Smeagol. No grudges, no grudges. Your realm is well defended, my friend. We heard you went on quite an adventure outside. The haze. That is some powerful art. Got lost at the river just a bit. Well, now you know not to try it again. Look at the young folk. They're too careless. Always used to having it their way. The blind elf is dangerous. 
dangerous, they say so. Yes, twisty elves, but what's our foe's foe? Our friend? Perhaps. But let us be good, my dear. Good as fish. Hey! Hey! Is it home, the strange elf? We hear it breathe. You're the prisoner, the one who talks funny. No, he doesn't. And smells funny. What was your name? Smeagol. Smeagol. Odd name. She's odd. So everyone keeps telling me. A deal, then. We leave each other alone, and we shall relish our solitude and noble oddity. What say you? Deal. She's odd, and we don't like her. Blind one. Where is it? It was my pleasure, Smeagol. We don't talk funny. Back again. Looks like we need to watch you more closely next time. Smeagol just wanted to wash the dirt away in the river. Uh, to which, I believe, we forbade you to go. Woodmen make nice carvings for children. Very nice. So this is not the game. He doesn't talk to us anymore. Maybe there's another way in. Letting Smeagol walk their beautiful halls. And why can't the blind one walk free like us, sweet wonders? Yes, poor girl. She was part of Gwendol's circle. The riddle master. Our most brilliant mind. He and his scholars tried to protect our realm with spells, but the Mirkwood devoured them all. Mel was the only one who returned, blinded and confused but alive. 
Whatever darkness touched her, she did not know or would not tell. She blamed herself for the fate of her friends. The king himself bound her to the cave, secured it with a spell to seal away the darkness. Maybe you can take her food sometimes. The children keep stealing her meals. Take whatever you like, just put it on the table by her window. But don't talk to her. Yes, it's not the best wine. Please don't take her too much of that. <coughs> Just come back if you change your mind. Just put some wine. There. Don't you want to take Mel something? <coughs> Maybe I'm gonna Good luck. Smeagol helps. Yes, always. To see what she likes. <coughs> Check what time uh, 24 minutes. You know, we can play five more minutes. What is he doing? Watching, thinking, scheming, or just biting his nails. It's hard to tell. Smeagol, come down. It's time for your fish. Nice fish, nice elves, nice Smeagol. Get something for Mel while you're there. Now, what shall we bring the blind one today, eh? <clears throat> How can anyone eat smelly herbs? He's full of pretty books. <laughs> I can't say I like it. At least Mel has someone to talk to. The pesto with her riddle. Brought herbs today. Ah, they're favorites. No wine. Well, probably for the better. 
I have my own gift for you today. The snail shell on my table. Put it in your mouth. The snail house? Why? You still haven't found the missing bell. Or have you? Smeagol tried. No silver bell. Not anywhere. You haven't looked in the king's chambers like I told you. Too many eyes. Cruel, shining eyes. Always watching. Good for them. Take the shell. Don't worry, there's only water inside. The silver bell. It breaks the curse that keeps her in the dark. You must always ask three times, yes? A custom of your tribe, the people of the Sizzling Hills. We're not from Sizzling Hills. There's one bell missing in the door. Put it back in place and the spell is broken. And the blind one can leave? You help me, I help you, as promised. Why does Smeagol need to drink? They warned you about me, didn't they? I must know that you trust me. Drink. It's merely water. Any news about him? The Riddle Master. Only rumors, fleeting words. So we free this. We drank it. Blind well done. The, bus. the water connects us now. We're free from this. Connects uh, us. If I made no mistake, let's give it a try. Only water, it said. It's merely water. And mere water it was. Now, go up to the pond with the stone tree. Wait there and listen for my voice. A voice? Man again, what are you two hatching? Just talking. Not nice being alone all the time. Not nice. Well, we to the pond, it says. Listen for my voice. What new Elvis trick is this? Is Gordian still neglecting his archery training? Look at the children. Songs and dances. Until they care about. So, I'm hearing you and Mel are becoming friendly. That's good. All her friends are gone, so maybe she will free us from your company as well. Well, she will tell a different tale, of course. But ask Gwendol how he feels about Mel today. The Riddle Master. But the elf said he's dead, and all of his friends, too. So there you have it. Still leads right to the king's doorsteps. But the elves won't let us go up there. So many rules. But we don't care about rules, do we? I will be there with you in the water. There's going to be a lot of water. Yeah. 
thing for the final Talking to yourself again? Leave us alone. Why don't they all leave us alone? I'm sorry. When I was his age, we'd spend all day and night in Egypt. Yes. We didn't need lessons in archery back then, my friend. I... Maybe the forest has become too dark and warm. Okay. Maybe it's our fault. We should be very Maybe this You know, the elven smiths of Aregion made the same mistakes. If your mind is ever focused on the things right before you, you sever the connection to the life around you, and you might easily be deceived. Why were they created if they are so fragile and ever-changing? We don't really know what we did. This middle earth is fragile and changing too. Where is Gabby? Maybe they fit this still out in the with the king. Old For trees us, talk slowly. The, <laughs> the king is not in his rooms now. That's our chance to find the bell. I wonder myself sometimes. Oh, not here again. Would long be gone if elves let us leave. Uh. Okay. So, see how far can we go? Don't like this plan, do we? What if the elves are right? What if she's evil? But what's evil to them may not be evil to us. So we'll start from here in our next video. Thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for more and don't forget to subscribe guys. It's free. It's free. It's free.